thought that that was far too young to be as unhealthy as I was. I chose to make this change while I can still easily make these changes and make a lifelong healthier option for myself. My name is Jenny Naglick and I'm the director of the Career Pathways program. I chose to do one of JCCC's wellness programs to get better overall. Some of the things that I do is I park in a faraway lot when I can. I'll take the stairs instead of an elevator. If something needs to be delivered, I'm the first one to take it. Instead of putting something in campus mail, I will go walk it to that office. During most of my lunches, I take a half hour lunch and walk with different coworkers a mile inside the campus, again, to stay healthy throughout the day. I have a Fitbit and some days with my walks that I do, I can reach 10,000 steps before I even leave JCCC. Supportive wellness means everything to me. Having our institution support our overall well-being makes me feel valued as an employee. I would not have done this on my own without their support and the community that I've built with other people who want to maintain this journey as well. I absolutely would encourage anyone to participate in uh, the offerings that we have here at this college. If anybody has cons, there will be 10 to 15 reasons why you should. So the pros will always outweigh the cons on having an overall healthier um, attitude and journey through life. I've wanted to make this change for years, but for me, putting the exercise more and eat less together always seemed like too much. I'm Jeff Hoyer. I'm the Director of Operations for Continuing Education. I've lost 45 pounds uh, in almost a year. I think that I had just decided that I must be getting older and that's why three flights of stairs makes me breathe a lot. Apparently when you get up in the morning, your feet hurt now. Okay, these are the things you get when you're older. Obviously I did get older, but being 45 pounds lighter I can go up and down stairs now and it isn't so horrible. I don't have foot pain in the morning. I feel younger. My good friend Susan Hoffman told me, hey, I might start a Weight Watchers group on campus. I did it because Susan did it and it turned out to be the perfect thing for me. And separating weight loss from exercise also seemed to fit because I felt like I could do one if I can't always get to the other. My family does Taekwondo, all four of us together. When we started Taekwondo, I thought, well, I'll just exercise and that way I won't have to adjust my eating. And I think in about four or five months, I put on 10 pounds <laughs> because I told myself, well, I'm exercising and wow, the cheeseburger is still good. So I kept eating it. And that was uh, kind of a light to me to say, okay, let me focus on the eating. And now, Exercising is so much easier. It feels better and it all feels easier. But what it means is I have a, a shot at an easier life and I, I really owe a lot to staff development. We all want to make improvements in our life. I wanted to exercise, I wanted to get my weight under control. Well, staff development is there to help me do both those things. And we stand in front of an incredible gym that I would have to pay hundreds for anywhere else in the world and it's free and it's at my workplace. So I think that that is a huge connection. And I'm so proud of the college for offering me these things as just part of my job here. I feel better and I'm healthier and I feel like I've got another shot at uh, doing it right.